A hostage situation, detainee deaths, and a jail board member's arrest. Problems are piling up inside St. Louis City's only jail. Now, one lawmaker is calling for the state to step in. State Senator Steve Roberts now demanding an audit of the City Justice Center. I'm Melanie Johnson here in studio tonight explaining what this lawmaker hopes to learn. Melanie. Yeah, Corey, Senator Steve Roberts tells First Alert 4 the mayor's lack of transparency is the reason the city jail is going downhill. Two inmate deaths along with a staff member being held hostage fueled his letter to launch a full investigation by the state. I don't see it getting better unless we take action. A call from State Senator Steve Roberts to the state of Missouri demanding accountability for what continues to happen inside the city justice center. Do you think that the mayor is doing enough to protect inmates inside that jail? Absolutely not, which is why I've reached out to our state auditor. On Wednesday, Roberts penned a letter to Missouri Auditor Scott Fitzpatrick asking for a full investigation. In it, he cites state law that says, quote, the auditor shall receive and initially review reports of allegations of improper governmental activities, including mismanagement. The citizens of the city of St. Louis have had enough. Something needs to be done. And if there's fraud, if there's mismanagement, um, hopefully by getting a state agency involved, we'll be able to discover and expose that. In two years, nine inmates have died inside the city's only jail. Public defender was trying to meet with their uh, client and they were informed that the jail, they just, they weren't able to find them. Last week, First Alert 4 received this exclusive video of an oversight board member dragged inside the lobby and detained. They wanted to get answers about a recent inmate's death and ended up with a trespassing citation. The Oversight Board's chair says they've recently received a board member's resignation. And when you've got board members who, you know, aren't supported by the mayor, aren't supported by the commissioner, and they're not able to do anything, of course they're going to leave. In August, more turmoil. A 70-year-old guard held hostage because detainees claimed they were not getting enough food. Steve Roberts says if he has to make changes in Jefferson City to fix what's happening at the St. Louis City Jail, he will. When we reached out to the mayor's office for comment, they decided to say no comment. Melanie Johnson, First Alert 4. All right, Melanie.